I went to buy four horse rugs for my horses yesterday in emergency because we have some really bad weather conditions out of the blue and I want to share with you about the backgrounds behind that. So usually my horses are happy outside horses, they're allowed to grow winter hair um, and they're allowed to be naked. <laughs> and only Tara sometimes is really cold and wet and windy, then she's cold and then she has a blanket. But usually I don't have rugs on my horses, but um, the current weather condition um, causes my horse to be really uncomfortable. So what happened? On Sunday, now it's Friday, we still had 32 degrees. <laughs> Celsius in Fahrenheit that's a hundred Fahrenheit so really a summer weather at the beginning of September very unusual and now today the temperatures plummeted to just 10 degrees and that is 30 no 50 Fahrenheit so that's a huge temperature drop <laughs> and my horse is absolutely zero winter coat yet I mean naturally we just said uh, 100 Fahrenheit, 32 degrees. They have no coat yet, so they have nothing to protect them. And they're announcing now five days straight of rain and 10 degrees only, uh, plus wind. <laughs> and these are some special conditions. Yes, my horses can go in the shelter, but always when you have two of the uglies combined, which is the uglies are cold, wind, humidity. If you have two of them combined, yeah, Masi. <laughs> then horses need some extra help and the easier get cold. And now we have even the three uglies combined. We have it suddenly really wet and humid. <laughs> we have it suddenly a lot colder and it's gonna be really windy. Not yet today, but it's going to come. They announced quite big storms. So this is why I got new rugs for my horses to protect them from these conditions because I know, you know when it's such awful weather, they are just going to hang here in the shelter and not move out. And then at one point they get really frustrated and grumpy and bored because they have nothing to do like Mazi men. <laughs> and then they start to push each other around. And so I give them blankets so at least they're not grumpy because they're cold. Huh? Mazi, do you want to get dressed? Yes? Okay. So the rugs I chose, they're heavy duty um, outdoor rugs and no filling for Maserati and Mayana because they're not so cold sensitive. And for Tara and Salim, it's just a super light filling of 50 grams. So not a heavy winter blanket of 200 grams. It would be way too much. Um, just some protection so the wind does not reach them and that they can't get wet. Huh, Mazi? Do we check it out? Mazi? Your blanket? Look. All new and shiny. <laughs> so, um, we're just gonna have one week of really awful weather and then we again have really nice and warm late autumn weather and then they have enough time to grow a nice thick winter coat so this is really just for a few days where they have no hair <laughs> and to protect them from the elements huh mazi yes let's check if all the clips are on and open mazi man yes all right mazi huh Mazi is not so used to rugs. I think I only put one on him um, once when he was like two years old. Kind of similar conditions. We went from hot summer weather to wet and rainy within a day. Huh? Yes, I'm gonna be a bit careful with him. Now, Mazi man, just gradually. That is a pretty color, Mazi man, huh? Yes. <laughs> Mayana does not recognize him anymore. <laughs> Mayana, it's still your Mazi man, huh? <laughs> huh? Yeah, it's still your Mazi man, Mayana. <laughs> that is so cute. Mazi, I like high neck rugs because with normal neck rugs, I often notice the rain goes here and it really runs down in the shoulder here. So I always try to get a high neck rug because I think it's just way nicer for horses who live outside. They don't have the water running in here on the shoulder. Huh? So <laughs> I think when blanketing horses, well, there's so many opinions out there. Some people always put a blanket on the horse and we really kind of uh, 
a system according to temperature, what blanket, what feeling to use. And other people, they are really hardcore. Let your horse grow a coat and be natural. <laughs> I think we totally have to use common sense. And what works for one does not necessarily work for another. And like what my horse is, some, some of mine, like Maserati is usually totally fine without a blanket. My young too, in winter because they grow coat like teddy bears. But, uh, well, tar girl, I sometimes call her, she's not waterproof. <laughs> Somehow, uh, the waterproof coating was forgotten with her. Um, she easily gets really miserable when it's cold and wet, especially and windy, and then she, she just stands and she shivers and she gets really rock hard muscles on her back. And then she just needs a light blanket to protect her. Not a big thick cover, but just a light blanket to protect her. And for example, just wanna give her a quick brush. And also for example, old horses who struggle to keep weight in the winter, uh, they really benefit from a rug and to protect them from the elements. Uh, because then it just need a little bit less energy to keep them warm and they just feel so much better. Or for example, a thoroughbred who doesn't grow a lot of coat in winter naturally because of the selection of breeding. Um, I would not leave such a horse out in winter <laughs> living in an open stable without a rug if a seed doesn't grow sufficient coat. So we always need to adapt to the horse we have and what the horse tells us and I think there are no fixed rules about blanket or no blanket and what is good and what is bad. But, uh, it's just what fits for the individual horse. Huh? New blanket for you too. Tara. So for Tara I have a 50 gram filling. So very, very light filling, not just waterproof like Maserati uh, because she's a bit more cold sensitive and sensitive to the wind. Tara. Tara is very used to having a blanket um, last winter. She almost always had one uh, because yeah, she's so sensitive to when it is cold and wet. Tara. Yes. Horse number two down. Just look at her face. She just made herself really dirty this morning. I have to take it off. And when she is cold, she really doesn't want to be touched. And like, ah, oh, ma, leave me alone. So and that is just another indicator for me. Uh, when I see my horse don't want to be touched anymore and groomed anymore, even though they love cuddles and grooming usually. Then I know they're uncomfortable. And, you know, in the way of keeping horses, I just use common sense and look like, okay, are my horses comfortable? Yes or no. And if they're not comfortable with the weather, I'm gonna just put them a rug on so they can't be a bit more comfortable again. I do not want my horse to suffer because they cannot put on just a nice fleece blanket or another pullover like we do when we are cold, huh? Yes. And in a month's time, they will have start growing the nice winter coat. It's not gonna be an issue anymore. But now, as they just have the summer coat, they didn't even properly start shedding it yet. They just need a little extra protection. Oh, Salima. Yeah, that's really ugly, huh? Yeah. Okay. I think Salima starts to look really miserable here. Ah. Huh? Oh, Salima. Yeah, my son, huh? Yeah, it's okay. Just gonna put that blanket on. You're gonna be better after. Yeah, my son. The Salima is anyway a very sensitive horse. Um, she shows her moods in a very nice way. Um, and gets them very shy and doesn't want to talk anymore. Eh, Masi! <laughs> so another reason when I would uh, put a rug on a horse all winter and kind of also to avoid that they grow a lot of coat would be when I keep a horse in consistent work 
all winter long because a horse that grows a really thick winter coat is going to sweat more when working in winter and then it's going to be quite a challenge to get the horse dry again after work. So and then it totally makes sense that you put a rug on the horse starting in September when the nights start to be below 10 degrees or it's about 40, no, 50 Fahrenheit to prevent the horse from growing really thick winter coat. Um, oh, of course, also, when you clip your horse, because you are somebody who is very active in the winter to train your horse uh, competitively. So in these cases, it absolutely makes sense to blanket your horse. I'm, yes, my horses do live natural outside. They're allowed to grow a big fat coat, but I'm not religious about it, you know. <laughs> we always have to adapt to the horse and situation in front of us. Amazi, Mayana is not happy about the blanket because she's got some sweet itch and she has to wear a blanket all summer long. And in, in, in autumn, she's like, oh, finally, I have to wear no more blanket. But now I see all her hair standing up. So I know she is cold. And she is the boss of everybody. Yo, my Janshin. Um, he's okay. And she can get super grumpy when she is cold. And then she starts to chase Salima and Tara around. And that can lead to dangerous situations. <laughs> he's so funny. Oh my God, Mazi. Huh? Take the straps down a little bit. So yeah, that I rock my horses now over the next few days when we have this awful weather is also um, a prevention of bad mood and accidents here in the shelter. Prevent the horse from chasing each other around because they're grumpy and hungover and frustrated and bored. So all horses taken care for. <laughs> oh Mazi, you're so funny, huh? Yes, you're so funny. He's already bored, huh? Yeah, you're already bored. Time for some no matter the weather games, huh? Yes. We will do that. Let's make blanketing really simple. When to blanket a horse? No hair and cold, blanket. Hair and not cold, no blanket. <laughs> of course, there are always reasons uh, why to blanket, when not to blanket, and you know different circumstances. Please use your common sense. If your horse is uncomfortable, put on the blanket. So what's your take on blanketing? How does your horse live? Do you blanket? Do you not blanket? Is your horse inside, outside in the winter time? Do you work your horse in the winter? Do you not work your horse in the winter? Um, let me know in the comments down below. And yeah, I'm curious to hear from you. Mazi, man. <laughs>